I have an in interesting revelation of Babylon in the last days. Uh, it's the banks and the corporations and their language is the legal language. It's the law of the sea, the law of the water. And so our country is, um, is under the control of the bankers, international uh, bankers were bankrupt to them. So when you try to find the truth in government, whenever you try to ask them questions uh, regarding the heart of the issue um, of your legal fiction, the capital letter name on your social security card, um, when you try to learn the truth about how it all works, um, you always end up with a roadblock and a lot of times um, what the government agent will say is, well, I'll have to talk to my lawyer. We'll have to talk to the lawyer, the city attorney or whatever because um, in the Bible it says, um, if you see oppression of the poor and violent perverting of justice and justice in a proverb, in a province, marvel not at the matter, for he that is higher than the highest regardeth, and there be higher than they. So, as I've been trying to find the truth in government, you can't find it because all they do is work for a paycheck. They're told what the law is. So, they don't know the law, they don't know where it's written down, they don't know how it turned out the way that it is. They just follow orders because they work for a paycheck. Your government works for a paycheck. The United States government, which is a corporation, works for a paycheck. When you ask them, they don't know nothing because they're just simply getting paid. They're following orders. Um, even congressmen don't know. And even if you do get some time with a con congressman, uh, which is which would be almost a miracle because uh, bureaucracy is so thick in this country that you just can't get the truth in this country anywhere. And a lot of times it comes down to the city will say, well, I don't know, I'll have to talk to my lawyer because, you know, the lawyers uh, know the legal language. They know the law of the sea. And even some of them don't fully understand it. Even judges don't fully understand the law of the sea and the law of commerce. They just uh, follow procedures. And the procedures and the law was all made by the bankers. So, so there's nobody that knows anything. You talk to a cop uh, or you interact with a cop, he's following orders. He doesn't know the law. He doesn't know the Constitution. He doesn't understand why he's following... Uh, uh, obeying the command of his officer. He doesn't know what the law reads. He doesn't know nothing about how they the codes have power when they uh, obviously uh, are in um, contradiction to the Constitution. They don't know why. They All they want to do is get a paycheck. All they want to do is feed their family and they don't know anything. They just follow rules. And that's the way our whole government works. So when you ask one guy, a, a government agent, a question, then you got to go above him because he don't know and then above him because he don't know. And, and the bankers are causing the oppression. They're causing um, the truth to be hidden uh, through the lawyers. And so that's why it says in Luke 11, um, 52, I think it is. Woe unto you lawyers, for you have taken away the key of knowledge. You entered in not yourselves, and them that were entering in you hindered. In other words, they don't want you to know the truth that, you know, your capital letter name is, is uh, legal fiction and you're contracting with the United States Corporation uh, and this takes away your rights and um, they have a right to hound you. The whole country's been tricked. You know, Revelations 18, 23, for by her sorceries were the nations 
deceived. So all the nations were deceived because uh, of the legal language or the law of the sea or simply because they control the whole thing and they use codes, which are words that have other meanings, the legal language. Oh, I hope somebody starts getting this because, man, I mean, you, got, you people got to wake up sometime.